My father, John Boyne, born on the 4th of April 1933, was a sixth generation farrier from Dublin City, Ireland. He finished school at 12 years of age and began his apprenticeship immediately under his father, master farrier Francis Boyne. Their city centre forge meant that they shod mainly heavy working horses for local firms, for example coal merchants, fruit and vegetable providers, public transport carriages, etc. of the 1950s, 60s and 70s. At 19, John became part of the farriery team of the Royal Dublin Society, which was, and still is, famous for the annual International Horse Show. When he was only 23, he became head farrier and remained so for over 40 years. Other clients include the Irish Army Equitation School, Tattersall's Horse Sales, University College Dublin Veterinary School and many studs and riding schools. In the early 70s, as Dublin became mechanised and the workhorse was disappearing, John opened another forge in the countryside of Wicklow. At this time he was asked by the Irish Horse Board to train apprentice farriers. He trained 15 young men and mentored many more. John owned many horses in his lifetime. He won several prizes for his show horses over the years and was the man to go to when buying a horse. Later in life, as his son John did most of the shoeing, both men became agents for Kirkhart Horseshoe Company in Ireland. This kept John Sr. very involved in the farrier world and he was always keen to learn of new shoeing techniques and innovations. Of course John was an Irish man, he had a less serious side too. He was well known as a storyteller and a man at home with all kinds of banter. As a man of much charm and charisma, people always remembered him even if they only met him once. Lastly, he formed a worldwide network of farriers and horse owners who sought him out over the years for his advice and knowledge, and that was before the internet. He passed away after a short illness on the 15th of August 2009. Thank you all who are involved with the nomination and induction process for the International Horseshoeing Hall of Fame. It is indeed a huge honour. Thank you again.